Hello and welcome to Zeta's Chivalry 2 survival runs. Today's map is Falmire and we're playing the special mode killing only archers. This map is a bit harder for this challenge because usually archers can spawn behind the walls or on some places really hard to reach. It's a fun mode, also challenging, but I also observe that whenever I do this run without commentaries people don't tune in to watch. And I agree, running around uh, aimlessly does not seem like much is going on, so I'd rather comment this one. So I've managed to get rid of one archer, while at the same time dueling with an ambusher. Archer was killed and I didn't pursue the ambusher, as that's not my objective. After healing up, I'm again scanning, just trying to find the way to the archer. I see one behind the rock and I'm going for a kill. Yeah, so this one is, was a bit easy, also Archer was damaged. Now I'm intentionally missing my swings in order to keep enemy at a distance, so they would not pursue. I'm still looking for Archers. Still looking for Archers. Going through enemy lines and not hurting them. I see one Archer, except one dude with Golden Dark. And also Mesa were trying to hurt me. So I could not get to the Archer yet. But no worries, I'll rinse and repeat. Now one Archer for some reason is behind our li their lines. So I can pursue him and kill him. This was an easy kill. Also Archer was a bit out of stamina after all the dueling. So there's a third Archer I managed to kill. Going around enemies, just baiting with some jabs. I mean, you could say it's a bit unfair, I'm not helping my teammates, but I'm here for the challenge. Since just surviving and getting a lot of kills is not that challenging for me, usually. Just some damage to get assist, nothing major. Another, if I see enemy who is not uh, in red, I can also dish some damage. So I get assists and also a team can proceed further into objective. But I'm not claiming any kills. At least I try not to. Ambusher. Hopefully he's still going for it. Even though he's damaged. I try to retreat as much as I can. Just laughing at him. As I hit him. And he understood that there was stamina and health. He can proceed. Some halberdier also received damage. Again, this is about you know keeping opponents at weapon length, so they would not pursue. Just tap and then the retreat. I get additional um, assist. And this time, enemy was just hit by friendly just before my hit landed. Sorry, this was not intentional. I just wanted to help my friendly. Without actually claiming the kill. No worries, I still go around. I want to be out of the view of the enemies. But one can see me. Just need to ensure that he retreats. Oh, damn it, another kill. Okay, I'll leave him be. Not gonna finish him. Hopefully, he'll be revived by friendlies. No, he actually went for the swim. That's right, that happens. So there's already two uh, enemies, uh, non archers were killed. So I'll keep track of this because this was not intentional. I go behind the enemy and I see the archers. So we see here are archers congregating because it's very safe for them on this hill next to the spawn. So that's why this stage is particularly hard to get to archers because they, after a few times, they will no longer spawn and go down. They just keep down the hill. So this makes uh, this stage particularly a bit difficult. You also need to time right. And another enemy uh, unfortunately killed. Didn't think that would be enough for him to be slain. Archer on the hill. But I cannot pursue. Because then me spawn wave came. So I freed back. Some fire. For good measure. And now try to return. Again, dishing some damage. Not intentionally missing the hit. 
Because that's not my point to uh, kill enemy infantry. I'm here to focus the archers. So far this stage was a bit uh, flaky. I still managed to kill, I think, three enemy infantry, which um, should not have happened. So I'll continue on and hopefully this improves. So now this stage also you see there is a wall where archers can mount it. And just getting to them will be really hard. But let's see. Again, I see no archers at the moment. But I see one here next to the cart. He's dead. And now I'm retreating. While damaging the enemy. To ensure they don't follow. Nice. Quick kill. Also enemy wave has just spawned. But uh, I was just in the nick of time. Able to get rid of the enemy. And some archer completely behind the crate. <laughs> I hit him once, unfortunately my overhead did not land, uh, you know, did not deliver enough damage. Now here, perfect, two kills. Actually just one, the second just died without my intervention. So still a uh, good engage since I've got the uh, enemy archer kill. And there was also enemy wave, just spawned. So pretty tough. Let's see here, this is a bit dangerous, but thankfully, um, one more kill, two more kills, now I need to turn back, it's very dangerous, and third kill of an archer, it's a very nice run here, and I was able to retreat without actually taking any damage, so I'm throwing some mullets into another archer. It's uh, pretty tough to hit, but uh, from two hits from the Molot, you still can kill an archer too. So far it's going well, a lot of archer kills, even though that stage was still quite challenging. So I tried to jab into the enemy, but since he's in the uh, parry, active parry, so my hit is automatically blocked, my jab. It's okay, I just ignore enemies. And just go through. There's an archer here, but he just died. And this one didn't. I can see there is he has a friend who is chasing me. But he actually came. What a stupid idea. I mean he had a plenty of time to escape, but instead he decided to do two on one. And in the end he died. So if you're an archer, don't go against uh, any vanguard who has a one hit kill weapon such as greatsword because you see one overhead and that's it he died now I went behind the enemy who was healing and now the here again but I see he's not red so I can do one damage this one again enemy just kicking them man this is a bit trolling I agree jab Jab, jab, and I killed an enemy with a jab. So third jab did the trick. So again, just trolling with the infantry, not trying to kill them. Three enemies, a bit uh, hairy situation, but I damaged two, and I retreat. See, they on, when once the enemy is low on HP, they don't really like to pursue you much, except they're very, very, the tenacity is over the roof. I see enemy archer behind the ammo crate. I got rid of him and there was also enemy infantry. So I quickly, you know, fighting retreat. So I go back and then reverse hit. Now I got hit. Luckily Vanguard threw away his weapon. So two side sweeps. Got rid of his motivation to fight on. But the knight pursued. So I retreated into friendly lines and I can now go back and heal if I want. Still looking for archers. Now this particular stage is quite good for taking care of the archers because they usually congregate somewhere around the roofs of the buildings. Not this one of course. I really don't like the special attack from standing in the position. It just basically uh, hits the ground all the time 
And it seems like the range is really bad. So I stabbed into the enemy. I jabbed into the enemy. I still leave him alone. So, received the assist. And that's good. I didn't want to kill him anyway. Some people just don't get it. They just want to slug it out even though they're very low. And I'm quite healthy. So, you just need to go and... You know, try and gauge uh, another time. If you're low on HP. Don't continue pressing into duels. So, after uh, finally we established some dominance at the beginning of this stage. Where we I can proceed onto the roofs and try to find enemy archers. So far nothing. And here I see three enemy archers. Four enemy archers on the roof. What a lucky harvest. So quickly. Four hits and three kills. So that's why Grace is great. Because it dishes out so much damage. Another archer. This time he did not escape. But he was good. I mean fighting on an even surface is always a challenge. Now fighting retreat a bit challenging. Always have to keep in in mind where I need to go. And also friendlies are blocking my way. So not the easiest escape, but uh, I managed. Yeah, probably an enemy team is not particularly skilled. Again, not trying to boast or, or anything, but if I escaped uh, like this from uh, pursuing four enemies, uh, that means they lacked uh, some really experienced people. Yes. Or maybe I was just lucky. So we managed to free the prisoners. There's still archers here. I'm bugged on the, this particular place. There are some bugs. They're not been breaking, but one archer. Two archers. Two hits, two kills. So I'm doing quite well. This stage particularly was fruitful for my playstyle. Let's continue. Now enemy is still going into next objective. Could not get the archer kill. But no worries, I'm doing quite well at the moment. This stage is okay for archer kills, but I mean for a special trick you need to go under the bridge and then just um, pop in behind the backs and kill as many archers as you want. So this rock for example. I see no archers there, so I'll just drop down. I wanted me to drop down too, just damaging him. Trying to escape. For some reason he just uh, presses left and right button. He just continues. I don't want to kill him. Two jobs, and I leave it for a friend to take care of him. Some people just don't hit, get hints. They try to be polite and tell them to leave me be here, but still they continue. Again I see no archers going behind. I see one archer, but it's tough. Because the knight was pursuing me. So I need to rethink the strategy. This bridge is not easy for archer kills. I see an archer. Oh my god. Will I get it? No. You see? Need to retreat back because enemy will inevitably spawn and come here. So I retreat back and they will try another day. Just kicking the enemy in the back. So friendlies are here already, but also there's a new wave just spawned. Want to hide here, but uh, friendlies jump down. So need to relocate to another side. And here too, there's plenty of friendlies, but maybe I'll get some archers. Finally, moment to shine. One. Two. I see another archer who just climbed the ladder. But I also saw three other enemies who were going there. So instead, I just go down. Get some stamina back and then just think again. Look for an opening. Archer still... On top he actually jumped down, but I can pursue, because any wave just spawned. I was able to escape. It's 
again <laughs> under the <laughs> under the bridge. One enemy burned um, to death. Two enemies burned to death. There is two enemy archers here. One, two kills. See, just if you wait for your time to shine, eventually you'll get it. But it's a bit, uh, you know, it requires a lot of preparation. As you can see, I quite it took. It's a long time since I downed an infantry. So my gameplay improved dramatically. Now this uh, stage is gone through, so we can continue to the next one. Now next is again a nightmare to get archer kills. Now here I thought I was dead. I thought this was out of bounds. Tried to jump several places and I couldn't. And then I found a um, place where I could jump. So it was a bit scary here, especially since I did quite well. So I go behind uh, through the scaffolding uh, on the right. See, there's an archer on Ballista. So he is killed. Two with one hit, special attack. Ah, there's no need uh, to finish him off. He'll bleed out. He bleed anyway. But there you go. Go back to the spawn point. So far, great. Uh, Thirty kills. I only focus archers, but uh, yeah, there was some by catch. I killed three enemy infantry, I think. That's a shame, but uh, things happen. Accidents happen. <laughs> and now she tries to shoot at me. So I mowed him. I'll get there, no worries. I'll get to him. But again, next stage is particularly hard because archers are usually next to the spawn points. And they don't jump down because uh, they are much more secure there. Some jump kill. And I still see Archer. But he's shielded by a Vanguard. Still want to let him go, but he doesn't let me. Bastard. Some motivation will be needed. I intentionally miss my swing. So I can keep him alive. Now, again, damaged by enemy. Apparently, I need to go back and heal, but it into more secure place. And that's what I do. Now it was a bit challenging because uh, there was quite a few enemies um, on the ground, so me jumping down was risky, but paid off this time. Let's hunt some archers. So I go back. To the wall and uh, you know, observing where the edges are. Usually they will be on the sides where you can find the, you know, the spawn. But I see here on Ballista two the archers. One kill. But there's also enemies here. Cannot pursue further. For some reason, did not get a kill, even though I did not get a kill notification and 50 points. But that's okay. Jabs, jabs. Fourth jab. Fifth jab. Six job. Okay. I'm not sure if I can count this as a kill. It was just jabs. Very nice limbo against enemy hit. And I leave him be and I continue on to the archers. I see an archer on the roof. I just faked uh, my retreat down. And now I try to pursue. It doesn't work. It does. See, he has some health, and the archer was taken out by another friendly. It's alright, it happens. I was dueling two people at the same time. Archer was damaged, so I received assistance only. Now I'm trying to help my fellow archer. I tried to jab, did not help. Again, missing my swing intentionally, so I would not harm the enemy. So you see, uh, that's the enemy archer shooting from the spawn. It's really hard to get to him. Really hard, because also risky. Uh, because you can be spotted by from a mile away. And also enemy spawn wave can be spawning. And then you'll have to slug it out and escape from uh, 10 or 15 enemies. 
So I try another spawn. I come here and I see no archers. Oh, I see one archer. Unfortunately, my overhead did not land. So I have to retreat. I have to go back. And I see an archer. Okay, I've got the kill, although it was very, very risky. So, got hit, very low on HP. Need to replenish. Now I need to go back into the fight. And I see enemy wave just spawned, so it's very risky. And actually, a few of them are coming here, I saw. So, I put the fire to per se did not to come here, but they still did. But they did not pursue me when I go and went downstairs. Now I'm checking if there are any archers there. And I see there's archer head popping on this roof. He thought it was safe spot, but it's not. And he dies. Not subjective. Friend is hitting me. I had to block. Again, going for another hunt of another archer. Was charged into by the enemy. That's okay. I'm very, uh, you know, healthy. It's not a problem. I see enemy archer shooting from another spawn. Again, very challenging location. But if they don't spawn downstairs and I kill only archers, I have to go and get him. I mean, it's not usually people do that, <laughs> but I do. One archer. And he dies in the spawn. He thought he was safe, but he wasn't. So our objective wise we're doing well. I wanted to help friendly by jabbing into the enemy. And I helped him. See, free jab. And I did my best, but unfortunately enemy threw um, something, a weapon, and killed the friendly that why was reviving anyway. So there was not much I could do there. Maybe not revive him? Maybe. Okay, let's continue. Since I'm not... Uh, since I'm not uh, the highest on the scoreboard, I'm not receiving a, a suggestion to be a hero. Which is natural, because I kill only archers. Instead of receiving a lot of points for kills. Of infantry too. I see an archer. He's far away. He's healing. But it's risky since enemy wave just spawned. So I tried to circle around the uh, tree to ensure that dude with a pull hammer does not follow me. But he does anyway. I'm still looking for that archer. I cannot find him. Come behind the enemies. Not actually engaging. And I see one archer. Kill them. So yeah, um, just a disclaimer. I will die here pretty soon because after all that hard work I still can do mistakes so I saw the scoreboard it's 38 kills having in mind I killed the like four infantry so all the others 34 I think are archers so that's very good and now I'll, I'll want to show you the mistake I do um, on the very last stage where it's safe but still the greed of Getting archers of a game. So yeah, soon I'll make a mistake. That will be crucial to this one. I mean, this happens. Uh, usually I like to play last stages uh, safer. But then I'll go behind the enemy. Oh, I see one enemy archer. We could not land the hit. I was quite frustrated because I was just on him. Unfortunately, I could not kill him. So now I make... Uh, uh, after this frustration, I'm ready to make another mistake. So watch, uh, I'm going on the roof. And I see an archer downstairs, but there's also enemy. So I did not calculate correctly the height. And now I know I'm in a hairy situation, I need to escape. So it works semi-well, but there's also enemy wave coming. 
So in the end, uh, I killed over 30 archers and still enjoyed the game immensely, so I decided to post it. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and see you next time.